hopefully our palate will be cleansed after that disgusting display that we've just been a part of, unfortunately. Oh, one man can put me in a better mood after. Those two guys put a sound out on things. Big teats! Yeah, really, the secret weapon of TMDK. A man who asserted his international superstardom through New Japan strong. He was a hidden gem in California for about a decade and really took it to the next level and strong. And teaming with the most recent man to forego the the excursion process you mentioned yesterday, the first man I believe you said since Tanahashi to jump right from Young Lion into a, a new faction like this. You know, in TNDK, in an environment like that, Perhaps Booster feels that he doesn't need his learning excursion because he gets that education on the job. Quite an education has been Alex Zane and Lance Archer. Yeah, you talk about education, I've learned a lot about the Japanese cuisine, most notably Japanese Taco Bell from Alex Zane. And I, I love I love the rally towels. I love there's there's handmade signs in the crowd that, that have tacos with Alex Zane's name on it. He is the sauce. At Taco Bell Japan, their corporate Twitter account follows like three people. One of them is Alex Zane. And to that I say, can you blame him? I mean, one of the great high flyers we've seen in quite some time. He made his Ring of Honor debut in 2020 by defeating a future world champion, Bandito. Stunned the crowd. And it's been nothing short of stunning here in New Japan. Uh-oh, look out. Bolted, bolted. I'm, I'm not making eye contact with this man. Suzuki rules apply. Right. You can take the man out of Suzuki Goon, but you cannot take the Suzuki Goon out of the man. Lance Archer's looking for his victim, and he's found him. Oh! Uh oh. Oh, yep. Yeah. No, no, no. Please leave us alone. Please leave us alone. Thank you. I saw it in the backstage comments last night. Alex Zane said his piece was just about to go and he gets yanked back by the, by the hair by Lance Archer. You're coming back here, yes sir. Yeah. Yeah, Lance, Lance and I are on a yes sir, no sir basis, that's for sure. And Corkin absolutely unglued here for Lance Archer. Oh, for Mr. Fuchsia, I would uh, be. Oh, 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 he's got some stones on him. Oh. He may have some stones, but you might want to check his brain, Chris. I Veritable brass monkeys in. And. We've heard of Mama said knock you out, and Monster said knock you out. I'm going for you, Tito! Oh, I want it! I ain't backing hey. down! Oh. And the bell is off. The match four has commenced. Monster Sauce, as you've aptly named them. Taking on TMDK. Oh, 
Oh, big teats. Oh, big, big teats has informed us that his screwdriver means the tequila screwdriver that he debuted last night. And the size of Lance Hart. Look at Tito. Tito back it down for no man. So he said last year, the first time. In a long time, the fans are allowed to cheer in Corcoran Hall. Oh, oh it was Tito and Minoru Suzuki. Oh, shit. I'm going to knock him the fuck out. Come on. Do something. Yeah. Oh, it's hard to celebrate And 21 years in this business just recently. Come on. Knock him down. And look at Tito. Ooh. <laughs> He's got a right separated Tito. shoulder. He might have a left separated shoulder. Oh! And Tito taking advantage of the situation there. Wow. Big chop. Ooh. That seems to be a word that translates in any language. We're having to apologize for a lot of people. Oh! And Archer! Shoulder tackle! And fans at home, I don't know if you can you can hear it, but we can certainly feel it. The love for Lance Archer here at Corbin Hall. And wherever he goes, there's a lot of love and respect for Lance Archer. A lot of danger as well. It's half the reason why Tony Khan hasn't been booking him much to Lance Archer's chagrin. Oh. And a big knife edge shot from Kuchta. Wow. We've seen him recently on Ring of Honor, though, and so hopefully every Thursday night you might be able to see Lance Archer. You can watch Ring of Honor, then follow it right up with New Japan on Access. Oh, Kuchta. Right under that left leg. Oh, beautiful front suplex stays right there. Here's the cover. Two. And the fundamentals are on point for Puchka. I mean, we talked about it earlier with, with Oscar. It's one thing to have experience. It's another. And we might yes, have. Yes, yes, sir. Go ahead. Open hand. Oh, take the hold. And, and we are just, our drink budget's going through the, the roof here. As the forum exchange, for those that did not see it, Lance Archer helped himself. Oh. To both, of, to, to both of our beverages. Oh, and Tito looking to break up the tag. Tito clearing Archer from the ring, and Archer looking to come back in. The referee, the oh, save yourself. And, and if it wasn't for the respect of the officials Lance Archer has, with a shockingly high amount, Lance Archer would be in the ring right now. Into Sato, the bravest man in Japan right now. And nothing but the respect of, of, of law and order prevented Lance Archer from getting his shots in again on Bad Dude Tito there. Oh, goodness. And Zane's chest is painted red at this point, slowly morphing into purple as the blood vessels pop. Oh. Hopes to like here one, two. Some smart little things done there by Tito. He was able to continue to keep Zane on his half of the ring. But he's playing a dangerous game as Zane inches closer and closer to Archer. Yeah, I think like Lance Archer is setting the table with Alex Zane. Seeming to be this. Oh. <laughs> trying to get a hold of Tito. Trying to set up this, this whole team name. Wants this to be a, a steady Giro going forward. No, I got to think that Lance Archer and. Might have eyes on the New Japan Strong Tag Team Champions, perhaps the ROH Tag Team Championships as well. Tag made, absolutely. I mean, I could see a world where Zayn and Archer, with a couple more matches under their belt, start to really click. I mean, they got the best of both worlds, the high flying, the power. As Pooch to big body slam. And again, the fundamentals are just perfect as he hopes the leg cover. Two. He wrestled nothing but fundamentals in the in the dojo, dojo system. And then, you know, coming into TMDK. 
And again, much like we said with the United Empire, the learning environment that you're in with TMDK, you've got Zach Sabre Jr. with his European catch style. Your bad dude Tito with, with the power that he brings. You've got you know, that Australian stylings of Shane Hayes, Mikey Nichols as, as a tag team, Rob Eagles as a junior heavyweight. Yeah, there, they got it all right now to CMDK. And they may, oh, kick to the midsection, wow. And they've got control of this bout. Oh, look out. And again, great repositioning on that German suplex to get Zane away from the corner, shooting the half cover here, one, two. Ooh. Again, those, those chest-like moves of Bad Dick Tito. Has Zane in trouble, looking to make a tag to Archer here. The outstretched arm. These waist locks have had Zane in trouble. Back suplex, nobody home. Pump kick! Archer wants it in the worst way. And you can see the outstretched arm. Look for the great one, Archer. Take the way. Oh, Fuji Da. Oh, oh. oh Fuji Da. Wow. Just collapsing Fuji Da. In a car wreck right there. Uh-oh. And the car wreck turning into a demolition derby here, Chris. It, and the ring is physically moving here at Corken Hall with every charge from Archer. Oh. <laughs> that is a near 300 man full sprinting corner to corner as Fujita up and down. Oh, let's see. There's some innovative, so to speak, tag team work oh. yesterday. Oh, oh. No. And there! Choke slam, moon salt, the choke salt, two! Wow! It's yeah. Zane, inside out of Tito! Oh, Tito caught it! Who caught? Oh, oh, goodness! On the inside, choke slam, countered by Fujita. Bad new Tito, who is not the legal man. Wow! Fujita hooks the legs, two, and Zane breaks it up. They will have turned this match around in an instant. With a TMDK side. And look at the double suplex. Oh. Archer sending Tito out. Oh. Smart. Dumps Archer can go over the relatively smaller man in Dalek Zane. Back elbow though connects. Zane, I believe, is the legal man in the red corner here. Oh, we've seen this one before. Second rope on the inside, all the way up top, Alex Zane. Punches to the midsection. Wow! With the boots up. What? Rope walk with the knee. Zane! Oh, Rolling heels. Archer with the cover. Too bad, Nutino. Saves the match for TMDK. Ooh. Oh, a scrap buster takes out Bad Dude oh. Tito. Wait a minute! Oh, still. Wait a minute, one, two. Archer able to kick out. Zane in. Fujita in there. The cuts of Kosei Fujita. Oh, he oh, leg drop. Slurred all over the mat. Cover, one, two, and that's it. Saw some great tag team combinations in this bout with Archer and Zane. And they found their target. It was Kusha. And a great game plan executed till its fullest. Archer and Zane may be a force here, not only tonight, but perhaps for the IWGP Heavyweight Tag Team Championships, the strong overweight titles. Or the Ring of Honor titles, perhaps. I think we've just gotten a little taste of murder sauce. 
Now, Zane, I know he was approaching that 100 kilos. I think in my mind with what we saw, it's worth him getting up and over into that heavyweight category. Because they would make fine opponents for Bishamon or the War Dogs. Uh -oh, uh -oh, here uh -oh, later tonight. Uh oh, uh-oh. Speaking of just getting a taste. I'm gonna make this real fast. I want to introduce you to Monster Sauce. Today, I celebrate my 23rd year. Need you son years, pro rest. And I couldn't be more proud to celebrate right here in Tokyo, Japan. I will be back. We will be back. Matane. Oh, oh, there you heard it. Way to get more of this. That's fine by me. A formidable team as they look to the future. Murder sauce has become. I'm going to fuck around. Murder Incorporated here at Kirken Hall. On April 12th, New Japan returns to Chicago. New Japan Strong's biggest event ever. Windy City Riot, live at the Wind Trust Arena. NJPW Academy at the LA Dojo. Looking to start your journey or add to your existing knowledge? NJPW Academy is the place to be. There's only one place to get New Japan strong, and that's the NJPW Academy. Head to NJPW1972.com for more information. I want you for NJPW Academy. Think of them from New Japan Strong. Oh, there's a big man. Unable to compete tonight. Oh. Well, oh my goodness. Independence Day had essentially just concluded in the United States as we went to air at roughly 6 p.m. local. But celebrating America apparently never stops for Team Filthy. Oh, it's a salute. Uh, well, Tom Lawler asking me maybe to, to pledge the Pledge of Allegiance to the I, I Team pledge allegiance to our savior, J.R. Kratos, who's sitting down with us in the inside here. He certainly is. J.R. Kratos joining us here on English Commentary. What's up, guys? Look Welcome. at these guys. Welcome to the booth. Celebrating America, are we today? Yeah, apparently. No. <laughs> I didn't get the memo. Well, filthy Tom Lawler coming off a huge win yesterday. As are UJR Kratos with the West Coast Wrecking Crew. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Undefeated. Yes, undefeated. <laughs> well, Royce Isaac's killing me right now with the Uncle Sam hat. Oh, yeah. The eyebrows do it for me. That's, that's attention to detail. And no, that's just filthy. And what a test Team Filthy has for them here today. Well, what a test for what an opportunity here for Team Filthy. Opposite, Hiroshi Tanahashi, Tomohiro Ishii, two thirds of the number of overweight six man tag team champions along with Kazuchika Okada. And 
and make his way to the ring first. A man who's become very popular here in Japan, the DKC, a strong stalwart. See one of the greatest never open weight champions, Tomohiro Ishii. And there he is, the ace. We talked a lot about future Hall of Famers. And let's remind everybody in that Tanahashi and Tomohiro Ishii, they don't get along. Correct. And Ishii hates Tanahashi's guts. But they're so good as individuals, especially when you throw a card in that situation. But they're seemingly unstoppable as ever our boy six fan tag team champions. It will be difficult to see what combination can defeat Ishii, Tanahashi, and Okada. You got three combinations right there. Three, wow. <laughs> three examples. Look at that. The Look power, just the, yes. the raw power of Royce Isaacs, as we see Tanahashi. That's just made out of leather, by the way. Let's say the, the raw power of America uh, taking on DKC right. and Ishii and Tanahashi. Notice I brought up 1783 and not 1776. So 1783, of course, peace was made. And then you guys came back over in 1812. What was that about? Uh, all right, all right. What was that about? That was right around House of Torture starting their feud with Chaos, right? Oh, I think geez. that's, yeah. Well, we have a huge six-man tag team bout here today. Uh, one thing I, I know, Kratos, like a lot of fans have been talking, and we saw what happened to you yesterday. Uh, you, but, like, can you talk a little bit about the situation with you and why you weren't I, I would, I would love to address that, but right now, look at, look at this. Look, just wow. look at this site. I mean, it just proves that filthy, Team Filthy belongs with the best in the ring. Yeah. It, it speaks to the rise and the d development of New Japan Strong. Jarrell Nelson made his Japanese debut yesterday, picked up the pinfall, and now in there with one of the greatest of all time, Hiroshi Tanahashi. One of the greatest, man. Is there any nerves? I, I mean, for there, there's just an aura. I mean, he, Tanahashi came over to say hello to us yesterday. There's just a presence, even when he's not wrestling. Is there any nerves oh, for now? I mean, yes, I mean, he's one of the greatest of all time. He's been in there with the greats, beating the greats. You don't know wrestling if you don't know who that is. And the wrist lock, and Nelson showing no signs of nerves right now, Chris. <laughs> Wow, great wrist lock exchange there. Look at that, look at that. Even he's in, yeah, oh. we're just getting filthy. It's getting filthy. Having to go to the eyes. Yeah. Oh. Oh. That, that was a good one. Yeah, you hear the encouragement from Royce Isaacs. Irish whip in the corner. It's Nelson charging in. Ooh, big back elbow. Oh, watch, watch the, watch the cross spot. Got There it is. Royce has that spring in it. That's all right. Get him, Tom. Oh, yes. Come on. Don't this let is, him play that. It's not Lucha Rules. Oh, Ishii. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. No love loss here between these two men. Absolutely not. They met in Vegas. Here we go. It was a great encounter. Just two strikers. Ooh. For that hamstring off the ropes. But look at Tanahashi. Oh. Ooh, ooh. He and Ishii do not get along. Able to go for the save and now the double oh. drop kicks. And Isaac's in. Oh. oh! Wow! What the hell's going on right now? Chaos ensuing, and I, I don't particularly mean the group Ishii's involved in. Yeah, what we're seeing is well, two thirds and every six round champions. A little bit of DK fire. Quick chops, quick kicks. Off the ropes, DKC. Sunset flip. Aloha, Lola. And he's hanging uh, he's on. Not, he's, not oh. gonna get, he's not gonna get Tom like that. Oh, oh. No. Oh. Oh. oh, grabbing a hold of the leg, trying to hyper-send it. Oh, he's got a knee bar here. Oh, Lawler gets into the table position to alleviate some of the pain. Come on, Tom, just get to the ropes, break this. In this situation, you know, he's talking about DKC and Lawler, Ian. Two of the very originals 
of New Japan strong back in the Lions Break collision days. Oh, trying to choke, absolutely. And really a reason, two of the reasons why New Japan Strong have been so successful ooh, are the LA Dojo, Young Lions, and, and Team Filthy. Ooh. <laughs> And to that point, Kratos, like, how does it feel for these guys that have been part of Strong for so long to finally be here in Corcoran Hall? Oh, yeah, I mean, it's it's a dream come true. I know that term's used frequently, but it really is, man. You know, we, Rocky put everything into Strong as a whole, and we were doing this in front of nobody. Look at that exchange, by the way, right now that's happening. You know, we were doing this in front of, no, you know, during COVID, and... And then what dividends it paid. Oh, oh my. DKC with the cannonball. I, I was on board when some of the crowds were allowed back in when we had restrictions. And we still had to wear a mask. I had to broadcast partially in a mask. Uh, I'm sure Chris remembers those days as well here on the Japanese side. There it is. Oh. And look at Royce. Oh, and oh then now, look at Royce. Look at Royce. Now we're here in Japan watching my boys take on some of the greats. Look at this strength right wow. here, by the way. Oh Royce my. Isaacs. Just marching around the ring. Royce He's been Isaacs. dipping in my protein. Huh? Oh, goodness. Oh, Look goodness. at that. Look at that. Tanahashi up. Uh, DKC getting the unique tour of Concrete Hall. The problem is it's upside down. And the blood So rush. proud of my. Look at them. Yes. Wow. Big double suplex. Was he going to walk around again? Well, he got a full <laughs> lap in. Oh. oh. Tana laid out in front of us. Had to wrestle for a long time with, with a broken rib, sustained it in Philadelphia, or it was DC, I beg your pardon, last month. A tag made. Cover, one, two. And almost a situation similar to yours, Kratos, kind of having to travel back and forth with an injury, and that can be exacerbated as we saw with you last night. Oh, yes, it's... it's it's not a fun process, man. And a quick tag made. And this is where Nelson and Isaacs go to work, the West Coast Wrecking Crew. Perennial contenders for the strong tag titles. Isaacs, knee to the midsection, DKC reeling here. Nelson, cover. Man, would, wouldn't it be something for Jarrell Nelson to score a pinfall two nights in a row here in court? It's looking like that's gonna happen. Shots to the midsection. I would, wouldn't give up, though, quite so easily on DKC, Chris. Certainly not. You can't argue oh. with that patented fire within DKC. Whoa, whoa. And Lawler, the quick tag to Isaacs. Oh, that diving spear. And it's Isaacs. Oh. DKC in big time trouble. Look at Isaacs, the explosiveness. Big elbow there. Hooks the leg. One, two. How well they, as we work together, it's the best to ever do it, man. That was awesome. Best to ever, well, you guys work together quite yes. well. But I see that uh, that confidence from Filthy Tom has worn up, oh, worn yeah. up on the best. As Isaacs, oh, look at Nelson holding DKC in the place. Quick tags. Wow, oh, what a bounce. And those star spangled overalls. Oh! Here it comes. Right. Take out your cameras, your phones. Get my camera out here. It's the best thing you'll ever see all day. You're doing the Kozlov thing. Too. You're taking pictures. Take too. a picture of that. Yeah, I mean, what? When in, when in Japan or when America's, I don't know. And there's, there's a this? USA yes. chant breaking That's out. That's right. Cork That's how powerful all. we are. Cork and all. Look at that. Amazing. Uh, Whoa, don't get too filthy. You know what? Don't get too filthy if on him, Jarrell. If I look like Jarrell, I'd probably do that too. I'm not going to yeah, lie. Yeah, me Tag too. Uh, yeah. well, I Good mean, point. That, as we said last night, thanks to Tom Lawler in the G1 last year, the filthy clap has spread entirely across Japan. Oh. 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 And that's just in wrestling. As One Lawler. more. Oh. One more. Lawler in the best shape of his career right now. He's physically, mentally. Nice snap mare. Excuse me, Russian leg sweep there. Oh, oh, there it is. You better get out of that or it's that, over. Yeah, that great yeah, knee bar. And yeah. Ta Tanahashi. Oh. Who knows that this could be trouble. Oh. And Nelson able to get Tanahashi out of there. 
DKC and DKC makes him trouble. trouble. Yep. Yeah, this is just that kind of heel head that Pooks oh. tap. And a lot of pain last night. Quick tags once again, and that's it's been almost indefensible for DKC just when he thinks he's got an opening, the, the quick tags are made. Yeah, not against us, man. It's not gonna happen. Oh. And by the hair, Nelson bringing up DKC. Oh, big European uppercut. Staggering the DKC. Isn't it just awesome to see Team Filthy and the champs take over? Oh. Japan, USA champ here. Are you serious? Oh, and Lawler oh. out to the outside there. Certainly unexpected. As swing and a miss. Oh, duck Tunde. Oh, big drop kick here. He's going to try to get past Nelson to get to Ishii. No easy task. Both men reorienting themselves. It's Nelson looking to make the tag to Isaacs. He does get KC. Oh, here we go, here we go. Wow. Shoulder to shoulder. Show him what's oh. up, Royce. Isaacs, Ishii. Ooh. Wow. Get up, get up. That's. They kick caught. Ishii, standing switch here. Ishii pulling Nelson for the Brain Buster. No, right hand misses. Oh! Shoulder tackle sends Lawler down. Kratos, are you, are you starting to get a little nervous now that DKC has, no, has made the tag? Not at all. Look at this. Oh! Not at all. Royce has it. And Isaac who's put on considerable muscle mass in the shoulders, through the chest. Looks like a million bucks. Yes, he does. Throw him around. Throw him around. Four arms just. Oh. Oh. Isaacs. Look at that. Oh. Speaking, Speaking of power. Speaking of power. And he may have turned off the lights for Ichi. Got that elbow right on the button here. And going to Shamal, boys. Good job. Right back from the clutch with the knees. Off the ropes. Oh, double axe. Blocks the Lariat. No one home. And waist lock. German suplex. Whoa! Close light misses. German suplex from Ishii. But it's Isaacs. Isaacs back to his feet. Here we go. Oh! Whoa! What an exchange. What an exchange. Listen to this place. The energy is just incredible for this battle. Oh, man. It's awesome to be witnessing this right now. And tag made. Here comes Tanahashi. Oh, big forearm. And Nelson kicked. Dragon's through the leg with. And what's the ball? It's a trifecta. Pro <laughs> Gray was paying allegiance to the flag moments ago. Now they're paying allegiance to the ace. Oh, top knee from Isaacs. Looking for his partners. And this has been their MO all night of Team Filthy. Isolate and attack. Yes, it is. We're going to work together right now. You're going to see this. Oh, oh Nelson! Nice. To the outside. Oh, Falcon Arrow hooks the leg. Isaac with the pin, too. Oh. oh. And I don't care who you are, a pinfall over Tanahashi would immediately catapult your career. Oh, in a heartbeat. No doubt about it. Say the least of the fact that he's current never overweight six man champion. You're going to see it right here. And this has been Royce Isaac's coming out party as he is in control. Deadlift, waistline, German suplex. Oh, that running knee. He may have knocked out of the You're going to see it. Oh. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh. Barely. Barking at Tanahashi to do something 
anything. She's left alone with Royce Isaacs, who's caught the play to Joel Nelson. And Isaacs has been the MVP of this bout as he has Tanahashi right where the West Coast Wrecking Crew on him. Oh, Dragon yeah. Suplex blocked. Oh, Isaacs into Nelson. Close line, waist lock. Oh, Isaacs into Lawler. Oh, into oh, a sleeper. Oh. Small package One, inside. Two, three. I'll tell you what, take nothing away from Team Filthy. Particularly impressed with Royce Isaacs in this bout, who came in, got control for his team, forced Ishii to make a tag to Tanahashi. Had Tanahashi right where he wanted. But the attempt at the double team, I think Isaacs, if he found the trust in himself, may have been able to cross the finish line. He gave just a little bit of an opening to Tanahashi, Kratos, and that's all Tanahashi needed. Yes, yes. Maybe next time Strong comes to Japan, Chris, maybe Isaacs takes the chance. Maybe he looks to finish Tanahashi off himself. I think maybe he got overcome by the aura of the legend that is Tanahashi. Well, perhaps so. Maybe next time when New Japan Strong comes to Japan, we'll make sure Kevin's here and finally gets his work out. <laughs> All right. Kevin's never going to show up, man. You hear that, Kevin? I know you're watching. Well, what Not but to get back to the match, you know, Team Filthy definitely held their own. You're in there with one of the greats, man. I mean, that's... All right, keep up the hard work, guys. Hey, Royce, where's this one going? Parts unknown. Tokon Shop Global. We ship worldwide. Why, buddy? You finished those Okada orders yet? Yeah, with the new Team Filthy shirt, papi. Genius. Eso, mi gente. The stars of today and the legends of the past come together on your smartphone. NJPW Collection. Pick up cards from special draft events. Use your collected cards to form your own faction or exchange them for limited edition special cards. Check in live from venues or remotely from home to get special tickets and items. Add all of New Japan Pro Wrestling to your collection now. NJPW Collection. Uh, they talk about Buzzkill. Yeah. We just saw a heated but fair sportswoman-like bout for the Women's Strong Championship. I'm sure we will see Nothing but the opposite oh, from these nice. two men. Look at this, oh, straight God. away. It's just when I thought these two men couldn't be even more confident. Yeah, let's get oh, right oh, away oh, out the gate and let's hassle the ticket bay in public. They think they can do whatever they want, whenever they want. Well, the problem is that up to right now, they've been able to do just that. And they were able to do just that last night against Bishamon. They've hijacked the NJPW Strong Openweight Tag Team Championships. And they're within a heartbeat of doing the same for the IWGP. And there was some additional damage. We talked about it, Chris, in last night's bout, where they not only went for the title, they went for the kill. And after the bout was perhaps the most disgusting element yet, attacking Yoshihashi over and over again as Goto was incapacitated on the outside with those strong open weight titles. Tonight, Bullet Club War Dogs, the team of Kid and Coughlin, have a chance to become double champions just like this team has before them. The credo of Bullet Club War Dogs. Bring gold, and if you can't bring gold, bring bodies. Gay Kid Alex Coughlin brought both. But Bishamon 
bring something more. They bring a connection. They bring soul. And when they're driven against oh. the wall, as they were last night, oh! they're the most dangerous men on the planet. Here we go. And Fishyman was ready from the jump. And we are taking this right to the outside. Up, toggling into Kid into the barricade. Gono with the two for one special there. Oh, and, and Goto, and maybe perhaps last night, I, I don't want to accuse Bishimon of taking it easy, but maybe they weren't prepared to go to the dark levels that War Dogs were. And maybe tonight they are. They've awakened the monsters. Exactly what Bishimon means. Oh. Oh. oh, right in front of us here, in the English commentary position. Of the old Buddhist gods of war. And those have been awakened in Yoshiashi and Hiroki Goto. That's right, she was called for the belt. This bout has officially started. Oh. Gabe Kid calls himself war ready, and now he's starting to feel what that really means. Yoshihashi in with Gabe Kidd in the red right corner. Quick tags made as we come to expect from Bishimon. And many times last night, it appeared that Bishimon on the same page. It was just that element of surprise from War Dogs. And this time, Bishimon not afraid to do a little surprising of their own. There's no doubt about it. Oh. The better team of these two combinations is Bishimon. And that's not cast in shade on Coughlin and Kidd, because these two are generational talents in the War Dog corner. Well, we saw the, the team element shine through with Bishimon. Unfortunately for them, it's, it's tough to fight with your back turn. It's tough to fight two on one. It's tough to fight when the advantage is continually ripped away from a team that has no regard for the rules. Yeah! Oh, just like that. Yeah, case in point, and Goto brought to the outside. As Coglin driving Goto into the barricade. And do not envy Red Shoes right now, trying to, to make sense, take order of this bout. Oh, nice right. chop. And watch out here. Right, ne oh, right next to us. And Gabe Kidd just choking Yoshihashi here with that chair. As Red Shoes trying to break things up now on the inside. Yeah, it's Coglin. Oh, choking Goto on the rope. No room to breathe. And Goto, and there's nothing that, there's yeah, nothing. There's nothing, there should be a five count going on in the ring right now. But Red Shoes, who's attention rightfully drawn to the outside here. Fuck you. Oh, give uh, me a break. Tag made. Oh, you want to jump first? You want to jump first? You want to jump first? Yes. Coggling. Popping the chest of Hiroki Goto. Goto trying to fight back here, firing back. Oh. And that's Coglin. Irish whip into the corner. Oh. And Gabe oh. Kidd look right there on the floor. Right around the outside. Oh. Again, it's this. This. It's this attitude, Ian, of what are you going to do? And there's nothing you can do. Dave Kidd and Alex Coughlin, they're the worst schoolyard bullies that you've ever had to face. They're double as tough as any of them. And perhaps the strongest you've ever seen. Look at this. Coughlin. With three Olympic lifts over 500 pounds. I mean, Coughlin is the strongest man in professional wrestling. Gabe Kidd has said it yesterday. A generational oh. talent. Coglin just doing whatever he wants with the 
your 250 pound body of Hiroki Goto. Cover here, one, two, can we have a new champions? No. Only the titles of Bishimon on the line here tonight. And Bishimon could enter these historic strong Independence Day events with two titles and lose both to the same team in two separate matches. Now what a dark era this would be. If Coughlin and Kidd were to be victorious, they would be champions number 100. Wow. And what statement that would make. A dark page in history. And an Irish whip, Goto looking to get back into this bout for Bishamon, charging in Coughlin with an answer for absolutely everything. Goto misses with the lariat. Oh, that time he does it. And Yossiasi hurting, pained, but pulling himself up because he knows he has to be there for his partner. And Goto. Keep kidding now, it's Yoshihashi. Shoulder tackle. Big back elbow. Yeah, Irish whip, corner to corner. Oh! One of the hardest chops in pro wrestling. And Game Kid just fell in. Big neck breaker there from Yoshihashi. Double axe clears Coglin. Front face lock. Oh, kid getting a taste of his own medicine. Oh, he's stuck, he can't get down. Oh. And that's a way to help you out. Just defenseless there. A lateral press hooks the leg. Two. This is where Yossi and Goto, they've got to get through it, Ian. Alex Coughlin wiped out for now on the floor. They've got to make the most of the time they have. But Goto is still winded out here on the floor as well. Front face lock. Yoshihashi with an opportunity here to take the advantage for Mishima. Shots to the obliques, to the hips. And the struggle, no one gets the suplex instead. Kid, like a coward, resorting to the eyes. Off the ropes. Oh! Oh! Pop up, there's Goto. Well, into the corner. Dragon makes it to Yushigoshi. Instead, it's Yoshihashi. Kick to the midsection. Here we go. Goto, Goto, Hato. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Just again, just like last night. And just like last night. And I hate to see it, and I hate to say it, but what skill that was for Kid to pull the referee at just the right time for Coughlin to use that chair. Impeccable timing indeed. That's kidding. That's kidding. No, that's excuse kidding. me? Uh, and I don't think that's empty talk either. Oh, God. Oh. Yoshihashi yeah. in the. Oh, it's just like oh, Double yesterday. Muscle Buster. And this is where the tide turned yesterday. You're right, Chris, too. Two count. Oh, uncalled for. If you want to win the match, just win the match. Don't put your hands on red shoes. What are you doing? My red shoes. The famous long leash. I win the IWGP Tag Team Champions. Get him up. Ring announcer Watanabe offered to ring the bell. Red Shoes says no. He wants to make sure oh. the fans see a winner, oh, and it a might not be the challengers. Oh, Yoshiashi! Two hit! Oh, two count only. Goto remains connected to Coglin. Ooh! Kid in the Coglin! Yoshiashi again! One, two, hit, go! Yoshiashi! Oh. Drop kick to the knee. <laughs> what is going on here? And, and Goto who needs to be in the red corner. <laughs> Goto told to go over to the opposite corner. Wow. Goto don't care. A big four on Yoshiashi, still the leader. Here we've seen this before. 
Yeah. It's Yoshihashi into Goto. Oh. Right hand. Directly across the jaw of Yoshihashi. Both men are down. Both teams are down as this IWGP Heavyweight Tag Team title match resets. Gabe Kidd back first now to one knee to a vertical base. Oh, planting that foot. It was time and time again when we were recovering from the pandemic. Oh, Yossi gets out of that pile driver time and time again. When Yoshiashi was never a boy, six-man champion in chaos. And there were 200 people in this building, and now there are 1,500. And then it was 300 and 400 that would come and see time and time again the guts of the headhunter of Hiroki Goto as they racked up defense after defense. And now having to lean on that soul, that heart, that drive to overcome the most dangerous of challenges. Kid back to the first. Yoshihashi up with him. Close lines connect. And again. Wow. Oh, come on. Just disgusting. Kid fighting Yoshihashi. Who connects with double open hand? Ah! And Fishyman looking to end things here, Chris. So the dogs of war, at least the gods of war. Final flash denied. Kick misses. Larry misses. Kick connects a kid. Coglin in for the save. Big boot. Oh! We may see it here, though. Oh, oh. single ocean and a top of Kid as well. Oh. It's Kid who's isolated. 8.33, bedtime for Goto. Night night. Shoto. Cover. Two. Three. Last night, Bullet Club War Dogs had the element of surprise, in my opinion. <laughs> to me, Chris, Coglin Kid played the perfect hand last night, attacking, seeking when there was zagging expected. <laughs> Well, Ian, I think, Lord help us all, if Gabe Kidd and Alex Coglin are allowed to run roughshod through New Japan Pro Wrestling. But as long as those two men are keeping the gates, then that time will not come just yet. You see Kidd, another marvelous effort. Same can be said for Coglin. They will not leave Japan empty-handed, however. They remain the strong tag team champions. They remain oh, two of the most oh, dangerous individuals in pro wrestling, no doubt on the map, but they are not the best tag team in the world. Those two are the best tag team in the world. Successful defense for the 99th IWGP Heavyweight Tag Team Champions, Hiroki Goto and Yoshihashi. What a bout and what a win for Fishimon here.